What's good, YouTube? Today we're gonna react to Jonah Wilson. Um, he just committed to Texas yesterday. He's a four-star receiver, about 6'3", and that was enough to make me, oh yeah, I gotta react to him, bro. Let's see what Texas got though. Offer up on his, on just on his head, bro. Using that height. Using it again. Ooh, that's what he gotta do though, bro. You 6'3", you gotta always use your height, man. Even if you got speed, you can be the fastest dude on the field. Use that height though, man. And he just running face on these boys, making it look so easy. <clears throat> and he also from Texas. I don't know if I said that. So, yep, another one in the collection. Oh, he, hey, he just running fades. <laughs> hey, they cannot stop him on a fade route. Jump ball, you not stopping him. Skinny post. That boy's tearing it up, bro. He just a deep threat. That's what it's looking like. He a real deep threat. He don't even have to run a short route. He gonna get all his money deep. Look at him, one-on-one. -on -one. Why do you got him in one-on-one -on -one coverage? Come on, bro. Unless that's the number one quarterback in the AC, which is not, Kamari McClain is in Florida. That's, <laughs> you shouldn't do that. Oh, he almost had it. The, the DB almost had it, but you gotta get that, either you gotta get that quicker, or you gotta go for the tackle next time. Put a little move on him. Put a little move on you. So yeah, he definitely like a possession deep threat type of receiver. From what I'm seeing is he don't look like he just super quick or like, you know, super with the moves, but he's a big body receiver. That's what I'm, um, I'm getting right now. See, look, the, everybody knew the play off. <laughs> I don't know if that was a touchdown or not, but you see everybody else just stopped. He was the only one that really went. Coach already knew to get the ball to him. Oh my God, that's filthy. That's filthy on two people though. And look at him, he had bro mad. <laughs> he had bro mad, hold on. Look, look at him right here. Yeah, at that boy. He like, man, <laughs> he can't say but though. He just, got, he just got snagged on, him and his buddy. Oh, the quarterback, ooh. Oh, that's him. I'm gonna say the quarterback going crazy. That's him back there. Oh, so they put him in at a little, like a little quarterback, a little trick play. Trying to run some trickery and it's working though. Unless he actually just really play quarterback sometimes. So that boy got an arm. Oh, they just do him just to like run and do short throws. I wonder which one is it. Do they just actually let them play quarterback sometimes? Like, like, like Brandon Denise. Say if his teammate got injured, when it, like the quarterback got injured, so he had to play quarterback, or he just like a backup quarterback. Like he only get run sometimes. Y'all let me know that in the comment section if y'all know. But yeah, man, Texas got him a big body receiver right here. They gonna need some people because um, well, I ain't gonna say they're gonna, they don't need nobody, but like. I think this year they're gonna probably have to replace uh Xavier Worthy because Xavier Worthy went crazy his freshman year. And I'm pretty sure he's gonna go crazy again this year. So who knows if he even come back for his third year. You know, he probably most likely will come back for his junior year, but usually in college, from what I be seeing is usually players leave and go pro once they have two really good years. And he had a really good freshman year, so I wouldn't be surprised if he if he have a really good sophomore year if he really go like literally go to the draft after that. That's usually what I be seeing. Like players usually have two good, really good years because some of them don't even play their freshman year. So that's why they lead their junior year. You know, that's usually how it is. Even if they just have one good year, which is their junior year, they usually leave um, after two good years or usually just their junior year. That's from like what I be seeing. So yeah, man. So they. Could potentially be losing him, and they gotta find somebody to replace that. Cause that's a dog. Xavier Worthy is a dog, bro. One of the best receivers in college. So we're gonna see if Jonah can um come in and make some noise, especially cause he with Arch too, though. They gotta get Arch some whips. I said some whips, some weapons though. And Jonte Cook, they could also get Jonte Cook. So Texas, they could have a really fun team with just this class, bro. When it's all said and done, um, we don't know if they're gonna get Jonte Cook. We don't know that yet. But from the teams I seen, 
I definitely think Texas is gonna get Jonte Cook because I don't feel like I don't feel like the other teams will really make that much of a you know like an argument with Texas. So it's tough that Jonte Cook didn't look at and them well put and them in his top three. But we Gucci up, man. We we still finna turn up. You know we finna get some good players. But yeah. Texas got a good one right here, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think of them in the comment section. I'm going to catch y'all next time.